So you have a Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 3, and you have an issue where you forgot your password or your PIN, and maybe you're trying to factory reset it. However, when you do a uh, factory reset or a hard reset, you need to turn off the phone first. However, when you try to turn off your phone, it's asking you for a password to turn off your phone, okay? Now, the thing is, don't forget, with a factory reset, you will lose everything on the phone, your photos, videos, uh, personal information is going to be long gone, and once you're done with the factory reset, it's going to be as if you pretty much bought this um, new and took it out of the box, and you have to proceed with the initial setup again. You know, choose your Wi-Fi, your language. You need to have to create new passwords and so on. So listen carefully, okay? So let's just pretend I forgot my PIN or my password. Now this is what you have to do. First thing is what we want to do is hold down the volume down and the power button. You want to press and hold bu both buttons and do not let go. We want to keep on holding for, for about 15 seconds. After 15 seconds, only let go of the volume down. Still keep pressing the um, power button. Hold the, Never take your finger off the power button. And then quickly move up to the up button. Hold both buttons and wait to see, to, until you see the Samsung logo, then let go. Okay, so remember, volume down, power, press and hold both buttons and keep on holding for 15 seconds. After 15 seconds, only let go of only the volume down and quickly press and hold the volume up. Okay, and then once you see the Samsung logo, we can let go of both. Okay, so we're going to do this together, okay? Volume down, power. Ready? One, two, three, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15, and then volume up. Oops. Press and hold the volume up now. Never take your finger off the uh, power button. Now I'm holding on both buttons, waiting for the Samsung logo. I might have to try it two or three more times. Let's see if this works the first time. Okay, Samsung logo. Let's let go. Let's see if this is going to boot us up into the Android recovery menu. If not, I have to, gonna have, I have to do it again. Okay, it did. It typically takes me like two or three times. I got pretty lucky on my first time. Anyway, from here, now you can move up or down using the volume up or down button. All right, what you want to do is go down to wipe data slash factory reset. Now, very, very important. Now, if you read down here, this is basically saying if you had a, G a Google account, basically a Gmail account linked to one of the email apps on the phone, the thing is after you proceed with the factory reset and you start your initial setup again, eventually it's going to ask you for your uh, Gmail and password to proceed with the initial setup. So, okay, so remember that. So we're going to proceed from here, white data slash factory reset. We're going to go ahead and tap on the power button right there. And then this is basically saying this cannot be undone. Don't forget you're going to lose all your information, personal information on here and photos and videos. So if you want to proceed, we're going to go down, volume down. We're going to highlight factory data reset. And then to select it, we're going to press on the power button right here. Okay, let us do this thing here. Okay, data wipe complete. Now it, it highlights up here, reboot system now is what we want. So we're going to go ahead and tap on the power button to reboot or restart the phone. Now this whole process is going to take about two or three minutes, so just be patient, okay? And it's going to sit on the Samsung Galaxy logo here for a little bit. And voila, there we go. We are in business. So pretty simple. Any... Uh, Questions or issues, just comment below. All right, good luck, guys. Bye.